There are times in life when people, circumstances, storms, even our own emotions come against us. We call those times, times of adversity. And whilst none of us go looking for adversity, there are times when adversity comes looking for us. Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond and welcome again to Fresh. Can I ask you today, how did you feel the last time you were faced with adversity? The last time the winds were against you? Did you want to run and hide perhaps? That's a very natural reaction by the way. We all have it. And yet as someone who over the years has spent a lot of time flying in planes, I'm often amazed that a plane always takes off and indeed lands into the wind rather than having the wind at its tail. Why? Because the laws of physics mean that with its nose into the wind, the plane can get both lift and drag depending on whether the pilot's trying to take off or land. It's a picture that serves us well when it comes to adversity. This idea of leaning into the wind, leaning into the adversity. Proverbs chapter 24 verse 10, if you faint in the day of adversity, your strength is small. Now that seems rather harsh, doesn't it? And yet it's on that day of adversity that our strength is tested. It's on that day of adversity where our strength truly matters. None of us ever feels particularly strong in the face of adversity. But something happens when in partnership with God, we lean into it, something quite remarkable. Just as that plane is able to rely time and time again on the invisible laws of physics, so you and I discover time and time again that we can rely on the invisible faithfulness of God. Don't faint on that day of adversity. Lean into it because God is in that place with you. That's his word fresh for you today. No matter what you're facing right now, God's word is the power to get you through. And not just to get you through, but in the midst of it all, make you a blessing to the people around you. That's what our latest booklet is all about, discovering your legacy of love. To request your free copy, head across to ChristianityWorks.com and you'll see that free offer right there toward the top of the homepage. But this is the very last week that you'll be able to request this particular booklet. So please don't miss out. Again, that web address is ChristianityWorks.com.